What's up everyone, Terry Schwartz again here to talk about Marvel's Luke Cage. We're nearing the halfway point. We just finished watching episode six, which if you haven't, you should not be on this video because I'm going to be reacting to it. So consider that your spoiler warning. Now, this is the episode where Cottonmouth gets arrested. Big deal, big spoiler if you have kept watching for whatever reason. But I came out of this episode just really even more fascinated by Mariah Dillard, his cousin. I think Alfred Woodard has been giving an amazing performance all season, but you know, the scene behind me where she had the reporter in her house and just watching her reaction to finding out that Cottonmouth, Cornell Stokes, uh, got arrested was really interesting. And this whole season, like I've been grappling with the fact that we were introduced to, to Cottonmouth as sort of being the main villain. Obviously there's been the talk of Diamondback and I think it's inevitable that we're gonna meet him at some point this season. Maybe he's the big bad. But with each passing episode, as, as Luke became more and more successful, Cottonmouth became, had less and less bite, if you will. Uh, and I've been curious, like, why they're doing that. Why has he been arrested at episode six? And I think it's because we're gonna see Mariah really rise up. Her character was Black Mariah from the comics. She was this big Luke Cage villain, and she even was called Black Mariah uh, earlier on by Cornell. And I feel like she's gonna lean into that. She has this legacy of Mama Mabel, and there was that question that she was asked, which is, you know, are, which side of Harlem are you representing? And I think she tried really hard to do the positive side, the side that wants to bring change and, and be a good councilwoman. But since she's had that taken away from her and she's had her name really run through the mud, I wouldn't be surprised if she took on the, the criminal empire and tried to just really get revenge on Luke that way. And she already did have some smart ideas, uh, you know, poison, drowning Luke. I think it's clear she's willing to do whatever it takes, whereas Cornell was much more concerned about his image. Now that she doesn't have that anymore, I think she's a, a real threat to be worried about. So I'm really excited about what's coming with her, and I think they have done a good job with the villains at keeping them really interesting, particularly Mariah. I'm, I'm curious about Diamondback. I think it's only a matter of time before we see him, and Shades has sort of stayed in the background, so hopefully he's coming to clean up Cottonmouth's mess sooner rather than later. So that's what I thought about the sixth episode of Marvel's Luke Cage. I would love to know your thoughts in the comments. And for all things Luke Cage, we're gonna be recapping each episode as quickly as I can watch and write about them. So make sure to keep up with those on IGN.com. And for all things Luke Cage, keep it here at IGN.